Hey guys, I'm back for some more Art of War 3, and this is gonna be a long battle, because it's an hour long battle. Okay, so I will try and force uh, fast forward the parts to make this battle as short as possible, but as sweet as possible as well. Okay, so we scouted out well, I'm upgrading my base. Since this is the bottleneck map, we are extremely lucky that we uh, we spawned in the middle because conjunction forces in conjunction work way better than forces split apart okay okay so this is my ally he is a random ally okay naval platform upgrading shipyard i hope there's epic naval uh, naval action okay getting my additional supply centers Getting a gun tower because I did see Delta action. Look at this. Two sh two level one shipyards mean one thing. Either Delta spam or Viking spam. And I put down the gun tower because I did not want to get hit from the rear. Like he could just go right there, come over here, and then hit me over here. And I don't want that. So I put up the gun tower for emergency measures while I upgraded to HQ4 because I plan on going for aviation. If I struck them both with bombers, it will be an easy victory, at least I hope. Okay, so my partner has some scouts scattered across the map. I have some hidden infantries as well. So it should be nice. My partner is laying mines because we can now see that it's to level 2 shipyards, which means eh, green is severely investing into the navy. And as we can see, this viking is trying to... Destroy the Kaiman while laying the mines. And there's a naval platform here, so he has to be careful. But luckily for him, he actually destroyed the Kaiman. Which is gonna set us back a little bit. And we can see he is upgrading to HQ level 4, which will be pretty good. Torpedo platform launching lots of torpedoes, dealing the best damage. But resistance torpedo platform is a joke. It's literally, it's literally half damage of a confed platform i mean it's literally just logic i go in with hawks i wanted to to destroy as many units as possible over here but he is advancing with a lot and lots uh, lots of units look flamers zeus i even saw some torrent and typhoons so this is not going to be an easy attack to destroy and in response to that i have constructed two gun towers here as emergency and meanwhile that is happening, I am upgrading my avia factories so I can start production of of, uh, of the uh, albatross. And as that is happening, there is a large line of vikings. Yeah, not gonna, you're not going to be able to uh, mine that area now. And as an SOS kind of thing, I have to go in with my hawks. Come on, come on, come on. Come on! That Viking's almost destroyed! Oh, man. Come on, can we take down this Viking? Nice, we did. Very nice. Okay, more naval platforms are being built. Green has a construction yard right there, so... Hmm, this is some good naval dominance. Him building the naval platforms here literally eliminate any mine placement because Kaimans have to stop to place mines so oh no flamers are coming I try moving my infantry but man the flamers how dare you flamers I don't like that that's a lot of torrents hopefully those torrents don't uh, cause some bad mischief Okay, upgrading my assault vehicle factory, making more gun towers. Okay, I saw some action over here. Another gator being produced. My ally does have a chameleon, but not much of a ground force. Meanwhile, I am going to be producing albatross. My goal here is that if I can target blue and take down blue with solely albatross it will be a 2v1 against green so that's going to be my hope and my plan
Okay, sending uh, infantry over here into the forest as scouts, but no. Flamers are scattered everywhere. We gotta hit them with hawks. Okay, let's let's see what the hawks can do. Oh, there's another flamer here as well. And nice, come on, come on. Ooh, there's a typhoon. One more re-entry. Okay, that was a good shot. There is a delta here, of course. But I got my gun towers, it should be under control. Good. Good. Okay. Deltas are trying to demine, and the Vikings are right behind. So. Yeah. Red is losing ground fast. I mean, Red should honestly just spam some naval platforms. That would be the best case scenario. So he can hold off. Now I got some bombers. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna try and scout them. Let's see what they got. Ooh, flame assault. Bruh, flame assault. HQ level 4, 2 level 3 assault vehicle factories, 1 level 2 special vehicle factory, a lot of supply centers. He has uh, more forces coming up from the uh, west. Let's see what green has. Level 4 HQ, an airfield, avia factory going for vertex maybe. Oh, the army is approaching. Okay. I'll use my bombers to attack this point. Let's see how it works out. Nice! We t <laughs> That was pretty good. That was honestly pretty good. If only we had another squadron of bombers, we could have annihilated the entire army. Looks like he's gonna go. He's gonna go! Oh! But my partner has JCP, it should be covered. Okay, Jaguar Fire is starting. Ooh, is Blue retreating? Dang, he's retreating, get wrecked, boy. Oh, but as he's retreating, green is coming up. Ooh. Yeah, as you guys can see, resistance naval platforms are pretty much of a joke. A bunch of Vikings can slaughter all that, lol. Okay, trying to build shipyards to delay the advance of the uh, of the fleet, but they're just going to keep coming. As the last naval platform has been destroyed. Yeah... Okay, so we just lost the naval ground. I try macroing my hawks as efficiently as possible, but it's not gonna work. Okay, so the ground force has temporarily stopped the fleet, but who knows? If green upgrades to Poseidons, it's gonna be a complete wreck. All he has to do is make some Poseidons, get some deltas, and it's a slaughter. Okay, going for your 2-5. I got more bombers. Green is coming in with deltas and vikings. But ooh, the viking force fire is really good. Ooh, Thor's! Thor spotted. I intercept with Hawks for a while, but I have to fall back because these naval platforms have too much anti-air. Thor spotted though. Okay. Blue is advancing again. Hmm, let's see. Where should we bomb though? 
Okay, I'm going to attack this line. Come on, come on, come on. No, no, we missed. Ah, oh, I hope that doesn't take a toll on us. Okay, gun towers are firing. Hawks are launching salvos, but falling as well. Thors, oh dang. Come on, come on, take down the Thor. Take it down. No. Naval platform. Oh, we got down another vertex. Nice. Imbahawk micro. Ooh, nuke. Building a nuke? Okay, but anyways, we are going to be attacking this area. I want to destroy the factories so we can prevent blue from, uh, from making an army again. Destroyed perfectly. I saw blue vertex. Oh, nice. Oh, intercepted, but that vertex didn't die. Ah, he knows I have a nuke. God, oh no. Oh no. Damn. Neither me or my partner have as much anti-air, so we got caught off guard there. And these stores keep coming, Vertex coming as well. Dang. Come on, one more. Ah, the Thor got away. Okay, let's fast forward. Okay, I start putting up a major portions of anti-air. Come on. Come on, deal the damage. Deal them damage. Okay, I send my albatross on a hit and run. I mean, not a hit and run. I mean, uh, a running hit. Let's see, let's see what they can do. Vertex are able to engage though, so Albatross are falling like flies. Come on. Okay, we got one airfield, but I was hoping we could get two. Ah, kinda sad. Hopefully no Vertex comes, come on. I sent another Albatross so I can take down that airfield, come on, let's see it. Nice! Perfect! Okay, so at this point, my ally is coming in with JCP, cleaning up the forces. Ooh, blue is walling it up. Gotta get past the wall. Thors are inbound. Rocket towers are being sent. Thors are also being sent. Albatross. Since I don't have much albatross, there's not much I can do. Okay, so this attack is pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, so the attack has been destroyed. But Thors are raining rampage. Oh, I got anti-air up, but the Thors, man. Oh, man. Hopefully this Thor can get destroyed. And nice. They destroyed a factory, so now it's going to be really hard to get Albatross. And I can't hit green. Like, he has way too much anti-air. I would lose so much Albatross on just a couple runs. So it's not a worthwhile thing to go and attack green. 
Blue's aerial superiority is taking down scouts across the map. Okay, I sent an albatross, but it got sniped down. Okay, so blue is recovering. Okay, rebuilding the lost factories. Both me and my partner have a slight upper hand. But because green is camping way too much, like look at this. Rocket tower, bunker, naval platforms everywhere. Come on, come on, man. But, uh, I am camping. <laughs> I am at least what is attempted of camping. Okay. This albatross got away. Nice. Okay, Thor is trying to destroy the army. Another Viking is coming. But I don't think sending a Viking in alone is a good idea. Oh, now he sent Vertex. Yeah. Okay. And so, instead of producing albatross, I switch gears and start producing hawks. Because, yeah, uh, my albatross is just not working. Oh no, oh no, don't you dare. Wow, that's a far anti-air reach. Look at that anti-air reach. Dang. Got a couple dragonflies to destroy that viking. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, we can't get too close, the range of the anti-air is too big. Come on, okay, fall back, fall back, fall back. Good, perfect. Okay, JCP coming up north instead. Let's go, let's see how this attack will go. So this strategic attack came from the spot where blue least expected it to come from i tell him that thors are going to come and so i wait in the middle with my hawks to see if the thors are coming thors are coming thors are coming where are the, where are the hawks no god i missed the thors <laughs> i missed them come on let's snipe them oh yeah satisfying snipe let's snipe them again Oh, yeah, that's so satisfying seeing Thor's drop out of the sky. Okay, so that's pretty good. Vertex Rampage along with Zeus. Now that the chameleon, the chameleon's fog has ran out, this attack is gone. We have no choice but to keep mass producing the units and throwing them uh, however we need. Okay, we're 40 minutes into the battle. 20 minutes left. We'll see what happens. Oh, there's lots of infantry. Okay, took down an airfield, but I have to fall back because the vertex might be coming. Oh, Vertex actually did catch up. Oh, wow. Vertex is faster than I thought. Thor's came for some reason. Hmm. I keep producing some Hawks so I can have aerial superiority. I need to be the king of the skies in this match if we want to win. And... Let's see. Let's see what happens. Okay, so 
false alarm. We're maxed out for CP. Time to scout what's over here. Okay, Thors are coming. Let's try and snipe them with my Hawks. Oh, nice. Triple Thor sniping down. Nice. That was pretty good. Okay, Blue's moving out with an army. Okay, okay. Take down that Avia factory. Oh, we almost take it down. We need to go in for a rerun. Oh, no, we're losing too much Hawks. Fall back, fall back. Oh, no, the Vertex. No, that's a lot of Vertex. Ooh, no, man. Hawks dropping down like flies. I only have two Hawks left. No. But since we did take down those factories, green will be set back a little bit. Although green does have vehicle production, in which I do not. Okay. Oh, what is this? Delta's coming in with a naval strike boost, I think. Oh, no, no, naval attack. Yeah. Delta's coming in from the rear with a naval attack boost. Having to use my hawks to engage. Blue's coming in from the south as well. And green has been destroyed. Vertex, come on, can we snipe? What? No, man, no, that's not fair. <laughs> that's not fair. Okay, I put some naval platforms down so we can have a little bit more anti-air. Vertex. Okay, let's see what blue's got. Zeus, Typhoons. No aviation on the airfields. But he is producing something, as you guys can see with the fan. Okay, so they have more activity. Uh, ooh, snipe them. Come on, come on. Okay, blue is coming in. I have to use my hawks to dish out some good damage. Typhoons. Okay, I let the I let my ally handle the rest. Nice. He's clumping up uh, unseaged typhoons. That's a big mistake. Okay, Blue's army has been destroyed, pretty nice. We have successfully destroyed an attack, so that should give us some activity points. And we are now attacking. No, no, that's bad, Chameleon, no! Oh man, why did you let your Chameleon go there, bro? Although there is a Cyclone, so I mean, the Chameleon wouldn't have done much. Bro, green is spamming buildings. 
Green is coming again with the same attack. But I'm going to destroy it. With the same kind of defense. So that attack has been destroyed. So I successfully defended attack which would give me extra activity points. But dang, they're still leading on activity? Damn. Oh, this is going to be hard. We got to spam some units. We got to take down their HQ so they cannot do anything. Nice. Let's fall back, fall back, fall back. Oh, no. The Vertex. Pesky Vertex. There we go. Engage naval platforms. Very nice. Perfect. That was beautiful. Okay, they're trying to rebuild, of course. Okay, let's see. I want to destroy the HQ one more time. Oh, wow. Come on, one more time, one more time. Nice. Oh, no! Oh, my... Whoa! Yo! That's a lot of Hux. What was that, like, Nine? Damn. Okay, this is the final battle. Final battle. Let's see it. Okay. Going in with some hawks. Hawk back. Hawk is back at you. Okay, come on. If we get some good intercepts, maybe we can pull off a win. Just maybe. Come on. Come on. Vertex. Come on, come on, come on. Hawks, come on. Just just deal out all the damage you possibly can, Hawks. Launch all the salvos. Nice interception. Porcupines, anti-air. Nice. Nice. Very good. Okay, dish out some uh, damage. Intercept as much as possible. Ah, good game.